What if I told you there's a beautiful crystal cave with 40 foot crystals in it, but it can kill you in 10 minutes? So you guys probably know I love crystals just as much as I love currency and other weird collectibles. And I thought I'd talk about one of the craziest places on earth or in earth that is out there. And that's the Selenite Cave in Nica, Mexico. This thing is like a murder cave. When you look at these photos, you're like, well, that's kind of unimpressive until you notice that these are dudes that are, you know, human size. This cave is almost 380 feet down into the ground. And it was found in 2000 by two brothers that work for a mining company that unearthed this cave that contains selenite crystal structures that are between like three feet and an upwards of almost 40 feet. Now these things weigh tons. The largest one weighs close to 13 tons and they're absolutely beautiful. But the nuts thing about this cave is it can literally kill a human being in less than about 10 minutes. So the cave itself has temperatures that are around the 130 degree mark in Fahrenheit, uh, around 30 or 40 degrees Celsius, and roughly has a humidity of about 100%, so right at 99.6%, which means the human body simply can't withstand that amount of heat. It's not just the heat that kills you. When we breathe, the water in our lungs is converted into the water in the air as we expel our breath. This is due to evaporation. So in this case, if you are in this cave without these protective suits like these scientists are wearing and these cooling suits that they have on, your lungs would simply have condensation built in them to the point that the layers of condensation built would reach a volume that you would drown within yourself. So that's pretty nuts. Think about just drowning in your own breath. So this cave is absolutely nuts. It's super beautiful. And currently it's submerged underwater, which is what it was when they first found it. So they pumped out all the water, they accessed the cave, and the most they were able to get it to with cooling suits and breath masks was about an hour for a person to be in there before they started to feel like they were gonna pass out. So what a crazy structure. It's easily one of the most beautiful but deadly locations on the entire planet. Let me know what you think about the Nika mines in Mexico in the comments below. I'll talk to you in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.